Hey loves, welcome back to my channel. It is Saturday. I um, am going to be doing batch posting. I had took this um, social media influencers class and the girl, um, her name is Christina and I actually follow her on um, uh, TikTok. And she told me that, well, she didn't tell me, but she told the class that it's best to batch post when you're um, like trying to get content and stuff like that to kind of grow your channels and everything. So that's what I'm going to be doing today. Um, I have we're really three rooms that I plan to decorate today um, that I've been putting it off, putting it off, putting it off, but I need to stop putting it off. So I'm going to go ahead and I'm going to do that. Y'all, I don't have my eyelashes on or anything. Like, we are out of food for the summer, and I cannot be more excited. I know I don't look like it. Like, my allergies are bothering me a little bit. But I'm going to go ahead. I'm going to record myself doing those three videos. And those will be three videos. Three videos I'm going to do today. Then I'm going to record myself because I'm going to get my nails done and then um after i do that um uh, what else am i going to do today i'm gonna do those three videos get my nails done i also want to go down to target to ooh, my face looks so dry so ashy but i'm gonna go down to target and pick up some um self-care items and then i kind of want to get my car ready for like the summertime since i have like a smaller suv like everybody think I'm supposed to drive. So I kind of want to just make, you know, my car, the comfortable car um, to drive my family and friends around in. So I'm going to do that. Um, and you know what? I'm going to make that another video. So they're going to be four videos, y'all. Four videos. Yes, I know. So on top of this vlog and those four videos, y'all, that's going to be five videos that I'm going to try to get together and get pushed out by Wednesday of next week. And so I'm gonna try to post like Sundays and Wednesdays, either Sunday or either Tuesdays and Thursdays. However, don't hold me to it. I'm gonna hold myself accountable for getting those videos out. But right now, y'all, I have been craving fried food. I don't know why, but I've been craving it. And I was on TikTok and I seen when people been making this fried salmon. Somebody made some fried salmon. It's 1227, so it's gonna be my brunch. I made fried salmon and make me some cheese grits, y'all. And hopefully it turns out good. So I'm about to go ahead and do that. So I can go ahead and kind of like get started on my other videos so that I can catch the nail salon before they close at like 7, 7.30. And um, also go down to Target. And I don't know. I don't know if I'm gonna do anything else. Cause those, cause these three rooms that I need to decorate, I feel like it's gonna take up a large portion of my day. And um, yeah, so it, like I said, it's the summertime and I plan to like get material out to you guys. Um, so if you want to see what I have up my sleeves and the different things that I'm doing to the house this summer, then stay tuned. All right, guys. So I'm going to be using um, a Louisiana style like fish, like fried batter or whatever. So I'm not going to use a whole lot of seasoning because I don't want this stuff too um, salty. So I'm just going to put like a little mustard on my salmon. And I'm going to add just like lemon pepper seasoning. And y'all, this right here is the best lemon pepper seasoning. I get it from Sam's, y'all. Y'all, it is so good. So I'm gonna use that seasoning and I'm gonna use lemon pepper. I love lemon pepper, y'all. So 
I'm not gonna go too crazy with it because like I said, that Louisiana style uh, fish fry, that breading is very seasoned. And if you, if you use too much, you ain't gonna be able to eat it. So I'm just going to coat this really good. And because like I want my, um, I like crunch. I'm also going to be using um, just a little bit of um, cornstarch too. So I'm gonna use just a little bit of cornstarch y'all. Just a little bit. I already have my um let me use the rest of this. I already have my um oil getting hot. Y'all can't think what is wrong with me. So yeah, y'all. Yes, last weekend was my birthday and I did absolutely nothing but lay in the bed. I was a little disappointed because I had something planned and it didn't go through. But y'all, when I say I have the best, most supportive friends, like they legit knew I was really disappointed because I had something planned for my birthday and because I couldn't get it done or whatever, like, like they showed out like with my gifts, my um you know just like the love and support that they poured on me for my birthday and even now like they still trying to make me go out and celebrate my birthday so i really appreciate them so um i'm making this salmon for me and my daughter my um my son, he really doesn't like fish, so I'm just gonna make him some bacon to go with his breakfast or whatever. So once you get done like breading, um, but this is what mine look like. Like this is what my um my salmon look like. So when I get ready to throw this thing up in the pot, y'all, ooh we it's gonna be so good. It's gonna be so good, y'all. Um, and I hope it's crispy, crispy, like, like I be seeing the people do on TikTok. So I'm gonna go ahead and, um, oh y'all, my head cut off. So I'm gonna go ahead and, um, clean up a little bit, wait for my grease to get warm, and I'm gonna go ahead and start on my cheesy grease. Yeah. Alright y'all, so my brunch, because now it's 1 o'clock, is finally done, and y'all know I had to try the first bite with y'all. Oh my god, y'all. This is really good. It's very crunchy. It is so good. And then, if y'all don't do sea salt and cheese in your grits, you ain't from the south. Sugar in your grits is for the children. We not doing cream and wheat. This is so good. I'm gonna go ahead, I'm gonna finish eating, clean up my dishes when I get done. I'll pick y'all back up because I know y'all don't want to see me eating. Mm, that's so good. Yeah, I'm in Target. This is so pretty. And I'm in one on the road like this. It's coming up like 
a rust color brown, but this is really cute. Ooh, and it's how much is this? Twenty-four dollars. That's a bit far. Should I get it, Liv? What you think? Should I get it? What like? Yeah, get it. I like that. It's cute. You like it? Do you really like it? You just say it. Again? They have some really cute sleep sets. Look, look at this one, Leah. And then, how much is this? This right here is only $20. That's cute. Come through, Target. I'm so upset, y'all, that we no longer have a Target in my city. I like these. I don't know why. Why do I like these? Why like? Why I I got the girl, girl, y'all. I gotta get me a pair of these. Like I think I need to do like a large, cause I like to be comfortable. You like these? Mm -hmm. You like these? These are cute, aren't they? Yeah. You like that one? I said I'm going to do a large because I like my stuff to be a little loose. Yeah. I don't really like the... But it's not a whole set, though. That's what I don't like. I want, like, a complete set. Tree hut, sugar scrubs, come to Target. Target got everything y'all need. And they had Dr. Tills. I heard that the two scrubs were pretty good as well. Which one is this? Ooh, strawberry. See what that's like. See what that like. You don't like it? It smells good, but it also stinks. <laughs> it smells good, but it stinks. It smells good. No, I like it. It's like a stench to it. What kind of stench? Like a sweaty stench like a sweaty stench like it don't smell clean it smells cleaner for then it keep, you keep sniffing like ooh. you think so mm -hmm. what about this one i want to try that one no this one i was trying to be you kind of it's yucky is it oh oh it's open that's the only one ain't it mm, smell good it smell fresh oh yes i want that one do they have another one? Do you see another one? No. Mm -mm. What's this one? Oh, that's a different one. Oh, that's the... No. It's the whip. See? I wonder what they face grows like. Oh, that's the cotton candy one. Did You had that one, right? You still have it? Come on, because I really need to go to the um, altar. You guys, like, if y'all want to try a new fresh scent, fresh scent for the summer, I just picked up the Fresh Peach Cupcake by Native, and I also got the Tada Vanilla Cupcake. Like, that one smells really sweet, but the Fresh Peach Cupcake smells like summertime in a bottle. I can't wait to get home and try it out, y'all. And it's at Target for $8.99. And see, like, y'all, I am so, like, um, jealous because in my Walmart, we don't have raw sugar products. And they have raw sugar. I thought maybe this right here would smell good, but it doesn't smell that good to me. Mm. I wonder what this does smell like. The watermelon. It smells good. <gasps> oh, it yeah. smells like candy. It smells like candy. It smells like watermelon. Oh, it smells so good. Here go the. Oh, I like this. Here go the watermelon. I gotta get this one too. It's okay. Mm, I don't like that one, but this smells really good. I like this. I can smell it for you. This one? Mm -hmm. Yeah. I'm gonna get this one. This, this smells, smells so good. good. 
Good morning, love. So it's Sunday and I'm so proud of myself because on uh, yesterday I told y'all that I was going to record yesterday and I did. I was able to go ahead and get um what one room done. I'm gonna try to go ahead and finish up the other two rooms that I have to get done today. But I just wanted to come on and show you guys everything that I picked up yesterday. I did go to the nail salon too. I got my nails done so y'all can't come for me. Um, so I went ahead and I got my nails done. I, uh, what else did I do? I also went to um, Target and I went to Ulta. Yes, I did. I'm actually about to get ready to run to Kroger because believe it or not, y'all, I think I may have like a um, like a summer cold or something like that going on. So I'm gonna go and get me some lemon and lemon and some ginger. Um normally whenever I'm not feeling well and I'm not really trying to take any medicine or anything like that, I'll um I'll drink that and it, it does help me feel a whole lot better. So um just like putting oil on my edges because I really want to you know protect my edges with these braids um just because you know you have braids it kind of like put tension on your hair or whatever so I just want to um protect my hair and I'm using this um Miel, Miel uh, Rosemary Mint Stop Scalp and Hair Treatment Oil. And I'm just going to spray it with this um, OGX. I like to spray my braids with this every day. It helps, like, it helps them, like, smell good as well as, like, give them, like, a nice, like, shine or whatever. And I also put some of that emu, some of that emu oil on my nose ring. And that just pretty much helps with like healing. And it's also going to make sure I don't have like, um, I don't get like a nose bump or whatever. And I'm going to tell y'all, every time I pick up my camera to record, my nose ring, it comes out like, I don't know, like yesterday, I didn't show that part, but I actually had to go back to the um, tattoo shop where I got my nose ring, and I had to get it put back in because it, it fell out. Like the first time it fell out was when, was when I recorded my nose piercing video. Um, so it fell out then, and then it fell out one more when I was getting ready to go to work. And then it fell out again on yesterday, so. And getting it put back in, y'all, it hurts. Like, the initial piercing, to me, it happened so fast. I didn't have a, a chance to think about, oh, my God, it hurts or whatever. But getting it put back in, it really does hurt because they don't use a tool. They just kind of, like, force it back in, and it hurts. So I'm hoping and praying it doesn't come out anymore. But I want to, y'all, I want to show y'all. The products that I picked up yesterday that I had no intentions on buying. I, I had no intentions on buying. I have heard about like the native products or whatever. And I did want to give those a try because I've heard they're so good. So I'm going to show y'all what I picked up from Target. Y'all, I went in Target and I spent $118. And when I look what I had in my cart, it went adding up, but so so expensive now. So 
No, let me start with native. Okay, um, so I actually went to um, Target and I picked up this fresh cup, fresh peach cupcake, y'all, from Native. And to me, it smells like summertime in a bottle. It smells really good. It smells really peachy. So if you're into like sweet, fruity scents for the summer, then you'll actually like this. Again, this is the Fresh Peach Cupcake Body Wash by Native. And I, like I was saying in the other part of the video, whatever. I'm upset because we don't have a Target in my area. We only have Walmart and Kroger. And they don't have these products. They don't sell. They sell Native, but they don't have these particular scents in store. And the next one I got was a tie-dye vanilla cupcake. Y'all, it smells... To me, it kind of smells like Fruit Loops. Like, it's really sweet. And it does have like a little cake batter scent to it, but I like it. Um, it's different. And if you like, like I said, fruity, girly, girly scents, it, it, this smells really good. Like, really good. I love this one. I also picked up the Tree Hood. Tropic Glow Firming Sugar Scrub. So I do plan to do a summertime um, shower routine after my workout because I have been working out. Um, I've been doing a lot of bike riding. So um, after I come home from bike riding and I take off like my sweatsuit, like I have to run to the shower because I'm drenched in, um, in sweat. So I will be incorporating this. And it smells really good. It smells really sweet. They have a strawberry scent that I wish I would have got, but I didn't. This one right here smells like, it smells really grown and sexy. I just love it. It doesn't smell fruity like the other Tree Hut scents. Like this one right here smells really good. And I can't wait to see if it does kind of like firm my, you know, my skin or whatever. So I'm excited about that one. And as I was leaving out of the body care aisle, you guys, I saw that they had raw sugar. Now, raw sugar is, like, new to me. Um, I've never used their products, but when I saw it, I was just intrigued. So, I was like, why not? So, it's the Simply Body Wash Cold Press, and I have the um, lemon sugar scent. And, y'all, when I say it smells just like a fresh cut lemon like it smells just like lemon like it smells really good um i didn't use this one last night but the one i use is actually my favorite it smells so good this one right here smells like a lemon pound cake and it's the raw sugar and i picked it up from um target it smells really good and this one is the Watermelon Fresh Mint by Raw Sugar, y'all. This right here smells so good. This right here, like this one is going to be my summer scent. Like I really need to go either back to Target soon or either go on um, Target's website and order this scent. If you love, like this one right here, take me back to child, childhood. Do y'all remember the Bubblicious Bubblegum? This is it. This one right here is the Bubblicious Bubblegum that we used to chew back in the day. That came like in the big old, um, in the big old like pink little block or whatever. I don't even know they still sell Bubblicious, but this is it. Like it smells so good. It's so fresh and it lathers up really, really well. And I want to say these right here were like $7.88 or $8.88. But they were, they were, I know, you know, both were under $10. But this one right here smells really good. So, if you love the Bubblicious when you were a kid, you'll like this too. It smells really good. And um, I also picked up these, um, like, sleep shorts. Aren't these cute, y'all? I hate the dick they did not have a, um, a camisole to match this one. But it's fine because I can always go... And find like a cami to um, match with it. But y'all know when I'm at home, I like luxury. I like to feel good. And it's summertime. I'm out of school, y'all. So I will be in a lot of PJs this summer. Just chilling in the house. 
I also went by Ulta and um, I have been seeing the girls all over YouTube talking about YouTube and um, TikTok talking about good molecules. So I got the Yubra, Yubra, Yubra Matte Wake Up Eye Gel. So I picked up this right here. I actually used it this morning um, up under my eyes kind of to help with light, you know, help me look more awake or whatever, because I'm tired. After doing that room yesterday, y'all, I'm tired. But um, this is what I picked up. And like the good molecule stuff was pretty um, inexpensive. Um, I'm gonna tell you guys, for this, for the um, matte wake up eye gel, it was only $6 like six dollars so yeah that was a really good buy i also picked up the ordinary hyaluronic acid uh, with two percent plus b5 i picked this up um from ulta as well and this was only 750. i haven't opened it i was going to i'm going to be doing a, like a new skincare routine because now that my endometriosis is like under control, I feel this on my skin. It's just um, trying to get back to normal, especially like right in here, like in this area right here. All of this right here was like hormonal because my body went through so many changes every month trying to fight through the endometriosis. So I'm really excited to use this. And you guys, this is a big bottle. And I love that it comes in like frosted glass. Just be very careful um, whenever you're using it so that you don't drop it. Um, so it says apply a few drops to face in the AM and PM before any type of cream. Um, so I'm excited to use this hyaluronic acid. Um, everyone that I've seen, they seem to love it. So I can't wait to give it a try. And I also picked up the Good Molecules Discolor Coloration Correcting Serum. Um, so I can't wait to give this a try. And this right here was $12. $12 and it's the Good Molecules Correcting Serum, Discoloration Correcting Serum. So I will most definitely be using this like in this facial area, like right up in here, to help with my discoloration. So yeah, let me see. Okay, so it comes like a little light like, dropper or whatever, y'all. Can y'all see it? It comes like a little dropper. And it smells like chemicals. I ain't even gonna lie, y'all. It smells like it, it smells like um <laughs> like a laboratory. It does. So hopefully it works out. And last but not least, I have seen Jackie Ina and all the other girls use this um Dermalogica um daily micro um daily microfoliant. So I can't wait to use it. I got the smaller size just to make sure it doesn't break out my um, skin. But it says daily microfoliant. Achieve brighter, smoother skin every day with this iconic exfoliating powder. It says it's, it's a rice-based powder. It activates upon um, you adding like a little water. So you just pretty much like shake a little bit into your hand, rub it together, it foams, and you just cleanse your face with it. So I picked up that and I also picked up my daughter a um, clarifying cleansing bar because she has like batney or whatever going on and that was only $5. So I spent um, $49 at Ulta yesterday, which was a good, you know, good thing because self-care is the best care. And it's summertime, y'all. You got to have your skin looking nice, looking cute. Can't be um, looking all crusty and dusty while I'm on vacation because I got some vacations planned this summer. So I'm super excited about that. So I'm about to get ready to run to Kroger and pick up um, my ginger and lemon and probably something. Go ahead and pick up something for dinner. 
so I can kind of get it out the way and come back home and get started on the room downstairs. So I just wanted to come back on here and let y'all know that everything I said I was going to do yesterday, I did it or either I worked towards it. So yes, thank you for holding me accountable. All right, love, so I'm actually coming in to end out this video, but I wanted to share with you guys my um, birthday gifts. And y'all, this year I turned 35. I didn't do anything for my birthday, um, but I received some really nice gifts and as well as like lunch dates with my friends and I truly appreciate them. Um, my husband, my sister, my mom, and my kids, I did an amazing job. This is one of the gifts that my sister gave me. And I smelt the lotion already. I smelt the Valentino lotion, y'all. This lotion smells really amazing. And whenever she wears the Valentino fragrance, it smells really good. So I was gifted the 3.4 fluid ounces. And of course, my husband and my kids, they got me another Louis Vuitton bag. And um, him and my daughter did a great job with picking this out. They actually got me, if you remember for Christmas, they got me the, was it the GM? Never, the never full GM. That's what they picked up. And for my birthday, they actually picked up the Neverfull MM with the pink interior, interior, um, with the blush interior. It's so cute. I can't wait to wear it. I'm actually getting ready to go out now, and I thought about wearing it, but I'm not going to wear it. But I just love this bag. I cannot wait to do a what's in my bag with you guys. I'm actually getting ready to do a what's in my bag um, for my larger never full. So just stay tuned for that, you guys. So like I said, I just came on to end out the video. Don't forget to like, comment, share, and subscribe. And I will see you guys in my next video. Bye.